I'll start recording as soon as I get my game launched and not loaded. Yep. Just wait. And hopefully you'll have a dead stop when I actually start when I actually get ready to spawn. Ooh. You know, keep going you right now. Give me those ideas. <laughs> it's not an issue right now. Like if you're moving, keep moving. But um, there was there's a point where I have to choose where I'm going to spawn in right now. I haven't started moving yet. box and brought all the materials back to the other box. So I need my two bottles. I really should make more bottles, but it's okay. There's a couple in a um, seat somewhere. Yeah, those are the ones I have to put away because otherwise I'll lose my shit. No, there's one each in an O2 generator as well because I made uh, made you one in one. So if you go to the O2 generator, there's a, a bottle of each. Not in that one. Oh, probably mine. Hello. Hello. I'm gonna turn that just notice that. Just notice that my backpack has the, the right above the top thruster has Keen, the uh, game developer's name on it. Oh yeah. I was suppose mine does too. I would have guessed so. Yes. Yeah. Um. Actually. There we go. I don't see it. Thank you. What? Uh, maybe on the different backpack. Yeah. Because I have the different. Uh, I think it's Got right above the thruster. I'm not sure what pack. What outfit I'm, wearing. I'm still wearing the tuxedo outfit, so maybe it's more. Oh, it's that that's a wiggy spot to stand, eh? Yeah, and I don't like standing <laughs> here at all. Um, so, yeah, so, so we're almost at the moon. Us, I noticed you brought us some asteroids. Yeah, um, there's just iron and. Fuck Silicon. All. I took a look, took a quick look around. Yeah, there's nothing really here. Okay, nothing to keep us here either. No, we've got a bunch of iron and silicon. At least nothing oh. that we more than we could use right now. Also started this. Oh. Okay, connector. A couple of boxes. Uh, Just one battery that a, for now. One whatever. battery. Yeah. I, I got to this point, and then I'm going. Okay, batteries and thrusters. Where can I make them safe and still access things? Because I still yeah. got to connect the pipes to the, the storage box. We should fill in that one battery, though, at the very least, so it can charge up while we're doing stuff. There is that. That way, anything else you're working on, you always have at least that much power. Okay, well, what do we need for this? Uh, like 20 power cells or something. Let me see. Uh, 20 power cells, steel plates, construction, computers. Two I'll just computers. slap one in the old build queue and see what, I don't, see what I'm not able to get. Huh. I need yeah, two computers not... and power cells. Uh, yeah, we have no power cells. No, make two, me two, two computers two. as well. Uh, the only thing it tells me I'm needing is steel plates and power cells, so I don't even think we need that. What well, said it needed two? It said it didn't need it two. I may already have them. Oh, fair. Yes. Okay, so all we need now is power cells. Because I basically put it in my build queue and all and told me I, I couldn't grab our steel plates and cells, so... Okay. Mm -hmm. Alright, so we might as well just start cruising to the moon, because that should have everything we need to uh, build this thing. We can make a moon base alpha. Moon base alpha. launch a cube at the Earth. <laughs> Wish there was shit down there we could blow up. Hmm. Well, we'll go. We'll go destroy a bunch of anything. So we'll turn on like reavers or something, and because we got to use it, use it, and probably lose it. No, I'll repaint it's once done. it's done. Can't just get all this crap out of my inventory. Well, got some construction components. Okay. So I've determined I don't have to sit outside. I can sit in there. What, in here? I just don't touch anything, and you can drive, I think. As long as you get in first. Let me know if you can't. Uh, I cannot do anything. Can you do it now? Yep. Can you do it now? Nope. I wonder if... If you sit in this seat, like, 
It's decided this is the primary cockpit. I don't want to change it in case we separate for some reason, but maybe try the other seat. I'm just going to set this one as main cockpit. So if we happen to separate, it won't matter because there's only one cockpit on me. Yeah, there you go. When we're merged, it should still remain the main cockpit. Yep, I can still fly. There we go. It's a better seat. I mean, outside's interesting, but... Okay, I'm just going to slowly maneuver us out of these rocks here. <laughs> I, I have a thought right now. Just hit me. Okay. Uh, we're going going to try and put this on the moon, so we're either yeah. going to use it or lose it. Um, we don't have any landing gear. All we got are mag plates. Yeah, we'll have to put a <clears throat> stick with landing gear underneath uh, my half. Well, we'll still have to stick it down a little bit because I'm hanging a refinery and a... You don't remember how big landing gear around. is? <laughs> oh, fair. fair. And I have to stick it right. under the ass end of my ship somewhere. I could stick it in the middle. No, because I'm going to have to tear that apart and those are half blocks anyway. I'm basically yeah, tearing the noses off of these things. It would be really cool in the middle. Mm. It would stay attached to one of the merge blocks. Yes, but I have to separate all of that and expand more space out. So it has to be basically underneath my aft. No, you just disconnect the merge block and move my ship to the right. Add the blocks you need and stick it back together again. Yeah, I suppose I could build a post off of that one there, but it'd just be easier to do it under my butt end. So I'm gonna have to read. I'm gonna be doing a lot of redesigning in that middle. Okay. So I'm gonna just stick it underneath my ass end once we get over there. Also, I have to move a couple of Actually, thrusters there is around. A spot. Yeah, there is a spot to put it. So. All right. How far are we from? Just under 32k. We are cruising at 75 meters a second right now. Yeah, there's that station there as well. So it's what I'm pointed right at. So once we get about 10k out, because I'm pretty sure the um, gravity well on this thing is only like four or five k, uh, come to a halt. We'll switch a couple of rear thrusters to point it downwards to make sure we've got enough lift. We currently weigh almost 500,000 kilograms. Yeah. And four thrusters on the moon should lift. If my math is correct, about 570. That doesn't really leave us much of a margin of error. Okay. Well, before we land, we could take two off the back end and add yep. four to the base. I'm just going to yeah. I'm just going to stick them on the either side of the um, the beacon on the back there, just enough yeah. to make sure we can land. Yeah. I'll stick a landing gear uh, underneath my section, and then once we get down, when found a find ourselves a place to build. By, by that station. Yeah, as close to the station as we can that also has all the shit we want. Uh, yes. Uh, we do not have the original uh, respawn pod. It's gone. No, it's not on my list of the, GPSs uh, or anything. The only GPS I have right now is the uh, station in front of us and uranium. I turned the uranium off because... I've I turned... Mean, I don't need it on, so I'm going to... I will turn it clutter. off the HUD, but it's the only one that I have. I deleted the iron. I don't have the... I had made one for uh, nickel so I could find it, but I've deleted that one. I still have an iron one. I don't know where the hell it is, so... It's straight next... It was not too far from the uranium, but who cares? The way I'm looking at it is also very Borg-like. We find something, we take what we need, and then we leave. And we don't come back to it. The only one I'm keeping <laughs> is uranium because that's a rare resource, and on the off chance we don't find any other, <laughs> we can at least jump back to there. Okay, well, I'll get rid of the iron. I'll get rid of the platinum. Yeah, they've been deleted. Wait, yeah, you mentioned that before. Sorry, I wanted to want to backtrack a little bit since we got about 10k to before we stop. Um, I even right. noticed it in one of the inventory boxes. Platinum. When the hell did we get platinum? I don't remember. <laughs> it was a while ago. I was just monkeying around. It's when I put the back in our first place because it's when I put the um, it literally must have been, panels. It must have been back yours. at the very first set of asteroids. <laughs> Yeah, because actually we just left that. So, yeah, up on the other side or something on the same rock, I found some platinum. That's so nuts. I put a little bit in the box. Yeah, we got like 30k of platinum just sitting there waiting to be used. We can't even refine the shit yet. No, but you know, it was there, so I figured I'd take it. Na -na -na. 
All right, I have discovered set up star makers. Okay. Oh. We're gonna set up our first base. I'm aiming a little low so that I can come, so I can peel up and head towards it instead of trying to go straight down at it. What's, oh yeah, where's the ice on this place? Ooh, there's a space station now. Who? What? Directly below idea. your ship, pretty much at your 5:30, below the 5:30 on the moon. STMK beacon. Yep, that's just a state a station in space. Cool. We got a row beacon 20 kilometers in front of us. There's two in space. Oh, there's the other one. Yeah, just finally picked it up. Right, the one on the planet is also row. Yeah. Okay, I'm bringing us to a hull. So about blue is planet, white is uh, space. And red would be bad. <laughs> and red would be bad. Cool. All right, we're a little... Okay, we're going to move forward a little further than this. Yeah, we're 15K out. You can get us. I'm going to get to 10. Still up the well. All right. Doink. Doink. Turn my thrusters back Oxygen. On. Take two thrusters off. I'll grab one, you grab the other. Take the middle ones, I guess. Yeah, it makes it look better. Whoa, Jesus Christ. I hate when my camera angle does that when I come out of the damn ship. It doesn't do it for me. Maybe because I'm a guest. I don't know. Oh, yeah, I got a better grinder than you. Ha <laughs> ha. I'll fix that once we get planet side. Okay. That's just so it's the same color. Nope, fair enough. Actually, it'll be fat. Actually, you know, it's probably the same time. If I help you and then you help me, it'd probably be the same if I did mine and you did yours. Yep. It only work if we had a third person jumping back and forth between us. All right, landing gear. Where's a good spot for it? Yeah, literally right. No, that's still a half block. Um, well, that is a half block, eh? Mm. This one isn't, though. Take out this light. Okay. Do, 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 do. All right, out of the way. Now go like that. And go like that. We'll put a standard landing gear there, but... Yep. Did. Six motors and five construction components, please. <laughs> Six motors is all we had. <laughs> Alright, I'll make a few more. Okay, give me control of that. Let's shred this mag plate because I don't need it. Dark. Yeah, where's the uh Must be on the other side of the sun of uh, the moon. Yep, it's on the other side of the moon. Based on the light on Earth here. Yeah. Well, we're going into darkness. Alright. I think we got some lights on the front of your ship. Move that ore detector and put a second landing gear there. Don't need it. Well, you might need it if you're, if you're symmetry. Around. Yeah, with all the shit that's sitting around your nose, we look for symmetry. <laughs> I'm looking from the back. There's nothing yeah. about this ship that's symmetry. <laughs> this is a, this is a just an abomination right now. <laughs> now yours is good. I got all little bits and pieces. All you got is a seat on top. Yeah, but this is all effectively one ship right now. Like I'm saying, the whole thing is just an abomination. Yeah, I'm having to keep my hut on for this, definitely. Right, I can even see the uh, bubble. The bubble of indestructibility. All right. First thing we find, There's I guess, another is iron. One on the planet. <laughs> well, there's two at the same spot. Okay. Oh no, stop 20. lag. There we go. Jesus Christ, that's some serious lag there for a second. Yeah, one's at yeah, I got uh, a row and an RDPR. 
Yeah, the one directly in front of us, and there's one at our 11 o'clock, and one at our, our 10.30, and then one at our 1 o'clock now. Oh, yeah. And there's the other one in space. we got stations all over the bloody place. Okay, well, we're 40 meters above ground right now, not detecting any uh, minerals per se. Nope. You want to pop in this place and see what she's got to, what's going on, and then we'll go look for something? No, yeah, I mean, we're here. We might as well hop in. Be rude, exactly. not just say hello. Exactly. Uh, over to your left, it looks like a decent landing gear. Landing gear, landing spot. That's good. We're not going to get any uh, recharge. Holy Nothing. Jesus. Well, that was that abrupt. Was a little bit more than I was expecting, yes. That was abrupt. Wow. Yep. I, I was, uh... that. <laughs> Holy shit. Came very close to breaking something over here. <laughs> yeah, a lot of black stuff came off of this one. All right, let's see what you got. Yeah, it's all right. Where's your Where you? Okay. There you are. We. Yeah, and they're all the same. The Ow. And that's a store. Oh, a torch. Oh, that's a store. Access denied. Ah. Some of the, yeah, there's a terminal we can access. The regular store we can't. Uh, it was downstairs. Well, sometimes there's stuff in those lockers, though. Yeah, it's just regular torches so far. Well, it's definitely not there. All right, let's go take a look. Oh. Can't jump off a ladder halfway. Nope. It's an all-or-nothing proposition. To a door, so I can't door I can open, and all it is is a freaking. Uh... Oop! <laughs> open that door. Bedrooms. Okay, one point two million for this ship. <laughs> this thing has ships for sale. Ooh, got some flare gun bullets. This thing has a lot of ships. Oh, and they sell zone chips, too. Is there storage in a bed? I don't know, but it no. probably would be an access design and denied anyway. It was. A couple of buggies and some, uh, definitely some chips. Oh, yeah? For sale well, at this one. Downstairs? Nope. Just one level. Well, I guess, yeah. Oh, yeah, there you are. It's over here. This one. You went past it. What do you got? Ooh, an aggressive miner. Oh, 1.1, though. That's a lot. How do... Yeah. Jesus. I'm going to see if I can find the uh, the mission board here. Bulk freighter hauler. 20 Contracts. million. Freighter. For example. Cool. If we could find some magnesium and bring 199 units of magnesium powder to this place, they'll pay us 6 million credits. So there's ways oh. for us to make some money. I, this contract will disappear at some point and be replaced with something else. That's and for an 253 metal grids, which we couldn't actually carry, we'll get 746,000. So I guess some of them are dumb. <laughs> for That's a lot of metal grids, though. Yes. Like, like I say, some of these things are dumb. Um, the one right below it would be significantly easier to pull off. And pays six million. <laughs> uh, yeah, the magnesium powder. Yeah. Couple couple boxes full, hundred and fourteen liters. And we give us six million credits. Like that's just ridiculous. Let me say we go scout yeah. around. Go scout around, see what we can find. We can right. find magnesium. <laughs> yeah, where's the way out of here? Take a while mm. to dig it out, but um, this no, this is not it. Yes. Not that way. That's a window. 
hell is this? Oh, this okay, is just the store. Okay. Close your own doors. I think they close on their own. Eventually. Let's go find some a place. Place to make home. I wish, was, <clears throat> I wish it was daylight so we can see the marks on the ground where the resources would be. Uh, that would be nice. Resource. Yeah. We'd have to go to our right. So let's head towards Earth. And then we'll get to a sunny side. Come on, give us something. Tempted to go back up into space and look for the crater. Uh, well, if you keep... Yeah, you're right, I guess. Eh? We're not going to see it if we just keep going straight because it could be to the... Well, it's, it's on one of the poles, right? Why does my uh, compass not work at all? Oh, because I'm in the ship. I'm not. I'm not standing. So it should be. I think it's at one of the poles, right? The crater? I don't think so. No, it's facing the, the Earth. Well, the ice is probably at one of the poles. Yes. There's another station on the ground. Yeah. Hang in this general vicinity. Because I think we find materials at that ice crater. Or we did when we were in it. What's that shiny? It was a good light? it was a good place to go. We basically just picked a big crater and went there. I think right. it's the, like, it is the big crater on the moon. Right. It wasn't the ice one, it was the big one. So at this point, I'm half tempted to just swing up into space and look for it. Yeah. We need the power. Catch some sun. Oh, there's the ice to the right. Okay. We are out of the gravity well. Let's just come to a halt. You know, if you want to run hydrogen, maybe we should uh, do it at the I ice mean, place. I mean, go to the ice. Like, if it's a big-ass crater, that's where we want to go. Because uh, we're going to need a lot of ice. To your left, you went too far. I wasn't down far enough. There we go. There you are. I see a crater. And I see a crater in the ice. Do you? Kind of pointed at it. Okay, go. Still not very nice looking terrain there. No. Keep going over it and see it's, there's nothing flat down there. So what? What, you think it's just right here? No. I don't know. We have the ice. You can go down and make a GPS for ice, and then we go look for the crater. Although there's one right in front of you. To your left. Stop. Too far. There you go. What's that? It's not huge. I was originally heading one to the right there. Well, just your left looks like it's got some nice flat ground in the middle of it, though. Yeah, the one I'm one mostly hovering over right now should do the same. Well, not hovering over, but... Here, let me point the ship at it. Uh, yeah, I just think the one at the left is even flatter, but it's got a mountain in the middle. That could prove interesting. Let's see what it looks like. How much power we got? Not a lot. Uh, 33 minutes. Yeah, we're going to have to land... Wait for some sun. Or dig up some ice and build a couple of hydrogen engines. Or Actually, we don't ice. need to. We have hydrogen what? engines on this ship. On both oh, do we? Yes, they come equipped with hydrogen engines. Oh, perfect. So all we need is a bunch of ice. Okay. 
Let's go recharge. All right, refueling. Ice. That's what we're doing. <laughs> we have found ice. ice. Iron. Oh, perfect. Nickel. Perfect. All we need is cobalt. <laughs> cobalt. Really? All in around that mound. Okay, you know what I want to do? <laughs> I'm going to ring this mound with blocks and we'll build our base with the rock coming up through the middle of it. <laughs> I'm bringing this over to... Because uh, I'm start, detecting like, iron, nickel, up. cobalt, and ice with all within like 60 meters of this position. Perfect. I can make this whole thing a drill. Oh my god. <laughs> we are down. Nice. All right, let's dig up some uh, backpacks full of ice and turn our hydrogen engines on to fuel up. Okay. Actually, should do it just on my sh could do it just on my ship because I'm not connected to yours by anything other than the merge blocks, but it will still provide power. So what? Why can't I put ice on both ships? We're because both we on. can continue using yours as a refueling station and mine as a recharging half. If we put it in yours and turn your hydrogen engine on, it'll suck all of the ice out of both of our ships and we won't be able to get a hydrogen or oxygen for ourselves. Okay. But if don't we only throw this, it in a mine... Don't touch this mountain. Not this one? No, that's where the base is going to go. All right. Flying over to the other one over here then. Or the floor or whatever. <laughs> it'll take a little longer to fuel up that way, but... Better to always have a spot where we can, you know, recharge ourselves. Yes, I don't disagree. I have a cat in my lap, so I'm just going to watch you uh, dig for a bit. Collect my uh, scraps? Yeah. All right. I should be able to just run up and pick up all the rest of this shit. Yep. Let me get out of, the Let me get out of your way. <laughs> Close Ooh, enough. A couple blocks that rolled over here. <laughs> oh, shit. I got them. No, I don't. <laughs> uh, so into your pigeon. Yeah, we're, we have direct the access generator? to the O generator. Yes, the O two generator is what I've got right here. So I got it up here too. All right, twenty k in there. Uh, it's got room for a bunch more. Where the hell were we digging? Um. All right, turn my hydrogen engine on. It's going to drain my oxygen tank completely, but that's all right. Or my hydrogen, what little hydrogen I've got, I guess. There's the whole... Oh. No, it's just draining itself. Okay, that's right. You're of 10 of 20,000 liters. You're almost full. My inventory is full. Yeah, the hydrogen engine is it now has just burned through almost all of its fuel. <laughs> the engine, where's the fuel in the? Oh, that's the engine. There may not be an actual hydrogen tank on this thing. No, there isn't. It's just the generator, so it just makes it and uses it. It's almost, yeah, it's burning through it. It's burning through what it had. That's the oxygen. It's putting out there. five megawatts, so it is charging up the batteries. I'll have to add a hydrogen tank to this thing. Even a couple of small ones will be handy. Where would you plumb it? I guess you'd put it where my chair is. Uh, they're small, so yeah, I'll have to take this thing off. Uh, what will I need here? Uh, so two genera. Okay. Uh, what do I need here? I need. Do, 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 do. No. Do, do. So you have we have a whole bunch of materials. Yeah. There's nickel. Cobalt. What do we need? We need cobalt for everything, eh? 
Pretty much, yes. So Cobalt's our primary one that we need right now. Nice. We've got everything where we want it. This will give us better tools, too, right? Now we need silver. Uh, Yeah, so we'll have to branch out a little bit to find that, but it's here. And there is the Cobalt. Cobalt! The lifeblood of all the cool stuff. Plunge mine around wheels. Ooh! Okay. Energy's low. Hmm. What was mine, actually? I bring cobalt. Five kilograms. It's a start. Here's the refinery. Am I in the wrong ship? No. Oh, there's a refinery. Stop that. Stop what? Well, that's the assembler. Oops. <laughs> the need is plates. All right, you got them queued up. All right, what are you making? Um, some hydrogen tanks. Oh, cool. So I can... Oh, right. So the hydrogen critical. engine can run. <laughs> forgot. I came back here for energy. I forgot. Yeah, that's good. All right, welded. So just more ice. All right, you. Oh, God damn it. Be... Need to get away from both. Black is too dark. Okay, no good, never mind. Yeah, maybe I'll stick blue. Just go with a different finish. Okay, so they're starting to fill up, which means I'll be able to charge the battery soon. Oh, that's something I can do, armor, though. More torn. Weldless. Retro future. What that looks like. Right. How did we... This is in a weird angle. Can we clip this, or... This is flat. Is it automatically flat? What? The block, sorry. I'm trying to put a block here. You have to change a setting, I think, for it to auto flat, because right now you, can, you might be able to just like slowly rotate them. No, it's flat. I can just rotate it, but it is flat. I'm, I'm up against your ship. Free placement mode is active. Press LB and RT to change placement mode. Free placement open in the alignment. Uh, elbow. I would do it. Gravity aligned placement mode is active. Perfect. So now it's going to be flat because it's aligned to gravity. Yeah. This is probably pretty good. So I don't want to be stupid with how I have to build, but I want that in the middle. Okay. Boom. Cool. What are you making? I'm um, extending something off the side of your rotor. Off the side of where I'm building the the miner thing. Drill yeah. rig? Mine, miner rig? Yep. Yeah, yeah, I've got it. Okay. What are you doing? I'm building a. Uh, I want to build a little uh, thing that can carry the uh, the ore detector around. Nice. Okay, I just need to put a standard. Uh, I can start building this now that we have cobalt. All right. Well, there's a frame to start. Nice. All 
Okay, what do I need for this cockpit? Uh, fortunately, displays Small I've steel made tubes, a couple. Bulletproof glass, computers. Oh, ten metal grids. Hmm. You used up metal grids. You made them. You used. I haven't cobalt. made any. I haven't used anything at all yet. Hey, you got Princess Leia hair. I'm not entirely certain how I'm going to end up doing the uh, thrust on this thing, but I wanted batteries in place first. Yeah, I don't know how I'm going to do the thrust on this thing either. I want to try and keep it as uh, compact as possible. But based on weight, he's going to need some big ones for... Well, not really big ones, I guess. Currently, we can afford to give up, well, as many thrusters as we need for components. So make whatever, take, strip a thruster off the, a couple thrusters off the ass end, whatever. Take those two I've got off the beacons. That gives you, if you shred the two that we added for extra lift, you've got enough to put 12 large thrusters on that thing. Yeah, I'm going to need large ion to lift stuff. I'm thinking six pointed down. Six pointed down, two forward, two back. So I can back out of a hole. And swing back. I'm not sure if my flashlight was on. Yeah, it was. All right, so this thing, I'm going to have to add a little bit on the middle here so I can grab the detector. Honestly, I could probably just get away with a single connector here. Oh, to grab a connector? Or to grab, grab the detector. Uh, the... But whatever am I going to, how am I going to factor in thrust? So I don't think I want to put that here. I don't know. Uh, let's find the really nice ones just for shits and giggles. Actually, no, the normal ones I think would look better in there. I haven't even figured out the thrust for mine, but uh... anyway, we'll figure that out. You're just grinding away here. It's boring. Yep. Come here. Whoop. <laughs> this, this is going to be our place. Where'd you go? There you go. This, <laughs> this is going to be our place. <laughs> it's gonna We're going to have this in the middle. Work our way all the way around this damn thing. Yeah, I mean, I'll go out a little bit on either, every side, and we can have another floor, possibly. We can go down with another floor, but this is going to be in the middle. Is cool. Our own little, yeah, this is this is Moon Base Zappa. Moon or Alpha, whatever Zappa, you want to call it. I like it. Frank Zappa, Moon Base Zappa. Yeah. Oh, yeah that's that's an where old it came from. But yeah, I like that. I want that inside, you know? Put some plants around it. Nice. Oh yeah, we can uh, we can generate oxygen here inside of the space as long as we get like I think like plant growing tubes or something, and the sunlight will uh, generate oxygen for us. I think that's really? an option. Oh yeah. yeah, 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 those little things. That's why some ships have those little plant pods. So right, free, I can put those. Oxygen. I haven't used those since we started this game. Like I, I think the only time we ever attempted that was Good Boy. <laughs> yeah, like way at the beginning. Cool. Definitely gotta find some oh, silver. Oh, sun's though. coming in. Nice. All right, well, we'll grind away. Next time, we'll go looking for some stuff. We got here. Cool. We settled in. Got everything we need. We'll be able to do uh, some easy exploration soon once I get that thing built. You'll be able to do some lovely mining or anything we find. But yep. You may not need to have to go too far out. You may, you'll probably have to go uh, use that thing to dig up some gold and silver. Because I'm fairly confident we'll find silicon in this section as well, since we've got iron, cobalt, and nickel. <laughs> yeah, I mean, I can use that for anything on the walls, but it's down 20 meters. We'll get to it. Each, each piston is 9 meters, so it would take two and a half pistons to get there, or three pistons to get into it. Make it like a little got plunge miner. Now, anyway, as you say. We can just keep grinding away, but we, we've got a good thing going here. Yeah, we got a nice place to set up base. And we got oh, Earth above Developing us. more hydrogen, filling up more hydrogen so I can load these, use the hydrogen engine to recharge. We got sun coming in. Things are going great. Yeah. Nobody died. It's excellent. Well, not so much. See everybody next week. See you. will die. Probably. <laughs> <laughs>